Welcome to Chacolas Town. This building was erected in 1952 and renovated in 1997. Let us guide you through the history of Nicosia, the last divided capital of Europe. The area which is known today as Nicosia was first inhabited 5,000 years ago. And also along the Pegueros River Bank. Around 700 BC, these small settlements became a single kingdom known as Lydra. During the Hellenistic period, when Cyprus belonged to the dynasty of the Ptolemies of Egypt, its name changed and it was renamed the City of the White Gods, or Lefkothea, to honor Lefkon, the son of King Ptolemy. In the early Christian period, its name changed again and the city was now called Lefusia or Nicosia. Nicosia became the capital of the island during the Byzantine period, after the people of Cyprus abandoned the coastal cities and moved inland in order to protect themselves from the Arab raids which lasted from the 7th to the 10th century. In 1184, Cyprus was under the rule of Isaac Comnenus, who proclaimed himself despot of Cyprus. In 1191, Richard the Lionheart conquered the island in order to free his fiancée, the Hungaria of Navarre, who had been mistreated by Isaac. He then sold it to the Order of the Templars, and the people of Nicosia revolted against them. The Templars were forced to return the Ibos to Richard, who immediately found a new buyer, the French noble Guy de Lusignan. The latter founded the medieval kingdom of Cyprus, and Nicosia remained the capital. The city kept growing and became a cosmopolitan capital with three 